Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Like I promised, um, we're going to be doing, well, I'm going to be showing you the things that you're going to need to be, to frame your canvases. So today, guys, if you guys remember, I picked these up from the uh, Salvation Army, and if I'm not mistaken, they were, um, I took the tag off, but they were uh, $2.99 a piece, so they made them $1.50, and they're by uh, Canvas, Canvas uh, Design. That's the maker of them. I absolutely love these pictures. Um, so I just wanted to frame them because you guys, as you remember, I actually changed the bathroom from gray, white. I think the bathroom was just gray and white. I add a, it's still a little gray in there because of the walls and some towels and stuff, but I wanted to incorporate black, you know, for, for male, for males too. I don't want everything looking all girly. So I promised you guys that I was going to be doing and showing you how I create my frames on my canvases. So what you're going to need is the choice of color paint that you want. So mine is gonna be the enamel. Um, this is the metallic gold. I think it's metallic gold. Let me look at it again, honey, so I can make sure I have the right. Yes, it's metallic gold, superior cover coverage. It's gloss finish acrylic paint, and it is dishwasher safe. So that's what I'm using. You're gonna need, all right guys, so sorry, the camera cut off, but what I was saying is, I was showing you guys everything you're gonna need for your canvas. So I'm just gonna go ahead on and start painting these so we can get this done so they can get dry. And then the next part of the video that you are going to see is actually gonna be me um, pay, uh, stapling these to the actual canvas. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm just gonna go ahead and go ahead and get most, most of these painted so I can do so. So they have to dry a little bit. They're not, the wood is not that thick. So you don't have to wait for a very long time. I should be able to get this video all together for you guys pretty soon. But I promised you that um, I will show you guys how I frame my canvases. Hope everybody's having an amazing day. Today is Friday, February the 21st, 2020. And um, I just want to say thank you guys for all my new subscribers. I really appreciate you being here. I appreciate you guys um, sharing my channel and helping me grow my channel. Uh, yeah, I really appreciate you guys. I really do. So as you know, for the newbies, I am a minimalist. So I like to save money. Um, that I want to get that out first. And um, oh, second of all, guys, if you, I like natural elements too. So that's why I'm using the wood. If you wanted to, you can still also go like to Lowe's or, or um, Home Depot and probably buy you a real thin uh, sleeve of metal and do the same thing. But it probably would, you want, I don't know. You, yeah, you probably could spray it. You could spray paint it gold, but you wouldn't be able to do it like this with the um, acrylic paint. So yeah, you can do that also if you wanted the metal look. But I like the wood look. It looks just the same. and. As long as nobody's up on it, you know, staring at it or nothing, it shouldn't be a big problem. If you got people in your house that's doing that or friends like that talking about, oh, wow, that's, you know, that's kind of weird. Just saying. Just wanted to say that. So, guys, yeah, I'm going to continue to do this and get these done. And then I will show you in the video of me stapling these after these drive. And um, you see how this paint goes a long way, you guys. So the only thing, I'm, I'm, spray, I'm doing the tops now of them. And then I'm going to have to go along the sides of them. So, yeah. So I'll see you guys in the next uh, clip. And y'all already know I'm going to throw in a picture of how they look on the wall. Um, I'm going to do a before and after picture. I'm going to have to remember that. A before and after picture to show you what it looked like before I um, actually put the gold on. Um, Trim it on. All right, so I'll see you guys shortly. Okay, guys. So, um, took a little break for a minute, but I just want to show you guys, like, really quick of what they look like so far. So, as you can see, I have them all done. So, what I wanted to, get, to remind you guys is to paint them down to the, the color that you want. If you wanted a vibrant gold or a vibrant silver, keep on painting them until you get your desired color. However, always remember, don't paint on the side that says Lowe's or Home Depot. Paint on the side that I showed you guys 
and um, you should be okay. So like I said, I got them all done. I got the sides, the, the sides are done on both sides. So that way when you see the canvas, you know, on either side from the front or the back, it will be, you know, it will be the way you like. So I think I'm gonna go over them one more time for my, for, for my liking. I'm gonna do one more time and then guys, I will be done. And then the next part, you'll just see me stapling, stapling them to the actual canvas. But I wanted to show you guys and get that out of the way before you guys do your own, okay? So I'll see you guys in the next uh, clip of the video, okay? Guess you can stay there and finish watching until I uh, get them to the desired texture or color of gold. And I just wanna make sure I stroke up, you know, like so. Just the ones that I see that seem a little dull, I'm just tracing over. Well, actually, just painting over it again. Oh, I love painting. It's so soothing. So soothing. So I will see you guys in the next uh, part of the video, okay? Okay, family, this is what they look before without the frame. And then what you're going to see next is with the frame. All right, guys, they are finally done. And this is what they look like. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. I can't wait to hang them up. So you guys will see the finished product in the bathroom. So there they are. Beautiful, beautiful.